Shofatim, Judges 13. And the children of Yashadael did evil again in the sight of Yahuwah. And Yahuwah delivered them into the hand of the Peleshitim forty years. And there was a certain man of Sorah, of the family of the Danim, whose name was Manoch, and his woman was barren, and bore not. And the angel of Yahuwah appeared unto the woman, and said unto her, Behold now, eth you are barren, and bear not, but you shall conceive, and bear a son. Now therefore beware, I pray you, and drink not wine nor strong drink, and eat not any unclean thing. For lo, you shall conceive, and bear a son, and no razor shall come on his head. For the child shall be a Nazir unto Elohim from the womb, and he shall begin to deliver eth Yashara'el out of the hand of the Peleshitim. Then the woman came and told her man, saying, A man of Elohim came unto me, and his countenance was like the countenance of an angel of Elohim, very terrible. But I asked him not whence he was, neither told he me eth his name. But he said unto me, Behold, you shall conceive and bear a son. And now drink no wine nor strong drink, neither eat any unclean thing, for the child shall be a Nazir to Elohim, from the womb to the day of his death. Then Manoch entreated El Yahuwah and said, O my Adonai, let the man of Elohim, which you did send, come again unto us, and teach us what we shall do unto the child that shall be born. And Elohim hearkened to the voice of Manoach, and the angel of Elohim came again unto the woman as she sat in the field. But Manoach, her man, was not with her. And the woman made haste, and ran, and showed her man, and said unto him, Behold, the man has appeared unto me, that came unto me the other day. And Manoah arose, and went after his woman, and came to the man, and said unto him, Are you the man that spoke unto the woman? And he said, I am. And Manoah said, now let your words come to pass. How shall we order the child, and how shall we do unto him? And the angel of Yahuwah said unto Manoach, Of all that I said unto the woman, let her beware. She said, Rather, she may not eat of anything that comes of the vine, neither let her drink wine or strong drink, nor eat any unclean thing. All that I commanded her, let her guard. And Manoach said unto the angel of Yahuwah, I pray you, let us detain you until we shall have made ready a kid for you. And the angel of Yahuwah said unto Manoach, rather Manoach, though, ye, though you detain me, I will not eat of your bread. And if you will offer a burnt offering, you must offer it unto Yahuwah. For Manoach knew not that he was an angel of Yahuwah. And Manoach said unto the angel of Yahuwah, What is your name, that when your sayings come to pass, we may do you honor? And the angel of Yahuwah said unto him, why ask you thus after my name, seeing it is secret? So Manoach took eth a kid with eth a meat offering, and offered it upon a rock unto Yahuwah, 
and the angel did wondrously, and Manoach and his woman looked on. For it came to pass, when the flame went up toward heaven from off the altar, that the angel of Yahuwah ascended in the flame of the altar. And Manoach and his woman looked on and fell on their faces to the ground. But the angel of Yahuwah did no more appear to Manoach and to his woman. Then Manoach knew that he was an angel of Yahuwah. And Manoach said unto his woman, We shall surely die, because we have seen Elohim. But his woman said unto him, If Yahuwah were pleased to kill us, he would not have received eth a burnt offering and a meat offering at our hands. Neither would he have showed us all these things, nor would, as at this time, have told us such things as these. And the woman bore a son, and called at his name Shimshan. And the child grew, and Yahuwah blessed him. And the Ruach Yahuwah began to move him at times in the camp of Dan, between Soha, rather Sorha, rather Sorah, and Eshtaol. Chapter 14. 